Turning now to some continuing coverage, major action over in Ontario County at the gas station in Clifton Springs, where a reported gas leak is severely affecting the community there. The DEC confirming to News 8 this afternoon there is contamination in the soil on the grounds, this prompting the pumps to ultimately be removed and to be torn down today. Isabel Garcia has been following up on this and brings us this report from Clifton Springs. The gas station at the corner of Kendall Street and West Main in Clifton Springs was taken down Wednesday afternoon by heavy equipment. This after a reported gas leak or spill of some sort, the DEC is still investigating exactly what happened here while action is being taken. <laughs> Heavy machinery was used to remove the final frame of the gas station at Crosby's in Clifton Springs. The DEC says the soil is found to be contaminated around the pumps. Tests are being conducted by the fire department, Reed Petroleum, and the DEC continuously. Now this is done using a photoionization detector, or PID, according to the DEC. Now the timeline of the issue goes back to July 31st, when the premium tank failed a test, prompting that to be pumped out that same day. The following week, on August 8th, according to the DEC, two of the other three tanks failed tightness tests. Reed then emptied all three. In a statement to News 8, the DEC says, quote, groundwater monitoring well testing shows no obvious evidence of new petroleum, only historically present material, end quote. I spoke with the mayor, Jim Keyes, over the phone Wednesday afternoon about the updates. He tells me he is continuing to receive those from the DEC as the continuous monitors come in of the levels at the various locations. He also continues to plan to make any community resources available for community members that may have questions. For now, now reporting in Clifton Springs, Isabel Garcia, News 8.